Hi, in this video we're going to show you how to enable the list view instead of the thumbnail view for your open programs and the uh, Windows taskbar. This should work the same for Windows 10 or Windows 11. So by default when you hover over your grouped items here, you can see you got the thumbnail view. In Windows 10 you could ungroup them, but as of now you can't ungroup them in Windows 11 without some third-party app. So we're going to just show you how to get this into a text view if you don't, or list view, I should say, if you don't want to have these thumbnails taking up your whole desktop there when you click on it. So to do that, we're going to open the registry editor. So just do a search for regedit. Okay, and then from there, I got a little cheat sheet here. We want to go to this uh, key here. So easiest way to do it is to copy and paste it from the description, press enter. And it'll take us there. Then we have task band. So we want to right-click and make a new DWORD 32-bit value. You could right-click on Taskband or just right-click in the blank spot here. And then just double-click that. Make sure it's set on zero. And then you just need to restart the computer or restart Windows Explorer. So we're just going to restart Windows Explorer here. So we'll go to Task Manager. You know, Right-click on Start for Windows 11. Right-click on the Taskbar for Windows 10. Task Manager. Now keep in mind, if you have some Windows Explorer windows open, it's not this one. You're going to have to scroll down the list here. It's usually at the bottom. Right-click on it, restart. You'll see your icons disappear. That's how, you, that's how you know it's working. So now, when we hover over it, you can see we have a list here. And then we could just toggle in between each one of them and then close them from here as well. And then, of course, if you don't want it, you just have to go back here, delete this uh, value right here, and then... Restart Windows Explorer again or the computer and you'll be back to normal. All right, thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe.